What's up guys, it's Nathan here, and I know that sounded real fucking stupid, but you had to do an intro for this video somehow, right? Uh, this is the first Warlands video on my channel, and I'll be uploading even more Warlands content. I'll also be uploading shit like Valorant or Call of Duty, if I even have the will to play those shitty games. I was too lazy to look up if somebody already did this video, so too bad, so sad if you already did. It is what it is. A disclaimer for the video is that there are technically spoilers, since I'm literally showing you the bosses you fight. And if you're one of those people that care about spoilers, you can click off this damn video. But like, come on, it's been... The game has been out for like 7 months on the Epic Store, and 2 months on Steam. And, you know, we're literally on DLC, on fucking DLC 2. And we're close to another update, and, you know, but it's whatever. Click off if you care about that shit. Um, but anyways, here's the list. Also, I've decided to leave out the takedown bosses, because who actually tries to farm them? And if you do, you could suck my. <laughs> All right. So at number five, we have the Jackpot. Um, located in the VIP tower for DLC one, the Handsome Jackpot. You know, whatever. Um, spoiler. Actually, I don't even remember the fucking ending. But it doesn't matter. So why this bitch? This is why this bitch ass is fucking annoying. Just cause look at him, bro. He's already tanky as it is. Um, I ha lucky enough, I have the right build. So, yeah. And as you can see right there, he started fucking nutty on me. So that's fucking annoying. These little peepee -pee loaders are so such little fucking shits. And so that's annoying too. And then second off, he has like four fucking phases. So I'm literally s I have to fight these enemies while he's fucking recharging. Like, why can't I just kill him off there, bro? But you know, that's how it was. So we, honestly, there's really no reason to farm this. And also, the shit he drops is garbage. So no reason to farm that. Like the class mods, it's okay. If depends who you're playing, I guess. If you think. And also, his crit spot changes. The fucking first time I was fighting him, I'm trying to shoot his head, and it's like, yo, what the fuck's going on? We're in the second phase. So in the second phase, he his crit spot changes to his hands. And, you know, that's... Is it annoying? Yeah, if you're fighting for the first time. But, you know, if you're a god alpha male like me, and you're, like, 2 billion IQ, then it's not a problem, but still. See, and th here's his third phase, which is annoying. And, yeah, you know, he's a bitch, bruh. But Jack isn't, bro. Jack, he's a real one, bruh. He is a real one. After seeing this story's villains, God, bro. <laughs> Jack... He was a real one, just to let you know. Oh, see? And uh, here is me shooting at his knees. You know, like giving him that fucking Todd Gurley arthritis. So, yeah, he's a bitch. Baby, I can make that pussy red. See, Alright, so at number four, we have this bitch made toy Calypso, bruh. Not only. Is he a bad character with his hot topic manager looking ass with his hockey puck earrings? But he's a bitch ass motherfucker to fight. All right. So as you can see here, he's launching his testicles at me, bro. His balls, and then you know, and then he he'll become invincible, which is mad annoying. So I'm literally just forced to sit there and wait. See, I'm just chilling, and he's doing whatever, probably beating his dick off. Like, oh, bro, what is he doing? What is he doing? <laughs> I have to shoot him to actually find me. What a pussy, bruh. And then also in the fight, he'll, you know, start charging at you, which is fucking weird, bruh. Like, stay off my dick, bruh. Please stay off my dick. Alright, and so. So, there's just so much things wrong with him. He also spawns these demolition tanks, which is probably one of the most annoying enemies in the game. Because they just be throwing mad fucking grenades at you, bruh. It's, it's so annoying, right? And fuck you, fuck off, Tyrant. Shut the fuck up already. But other than that, yeah, he's a bitch as of a character. Um, annoying to fight. Uh, he also killed Maya. Spoiler alert. So he's a bitch for that. Even though I didn't even play Maya, I didn't really like Maya. She's okay. But still, he killed you know one of the OG Vault Hunters from Borderlands 2. So he's a bitch for that. Um, yeah. Other than that, he's a bitch. He's annoying to fight. And like, come on. Like you don't even. You don't even need to find it to know he's a, like annoying, bro. Have you seen him? If you play the story, you know he mad annoying, bro. So that's all I have to say about this bitch ass Troy Calypso. 
Alright, so at number three, we have bitch ho ass Genevieve, bruh. So, alright, so as you can see, she has two health bars already, which is taking my time, right? I'm not trying to fight a boss for that long. So she has shield and then her normal health bar, which is annoying. She also has these little bots, um, not as annoying, but this attack right here, mad stupid, bruh. Hit you like a truck, bruh. These COVID-19 balls looking fucking whatever this shit is but it looks like fucking for the virus COVID-19 type shit you know that shit hits you like a truck honestly and that's basically like 2020 you know COVID-19 boom fucking kills your ass bruh I mean it doesn't kill you but kills your whole fucking year basically right and so other than that she also moves around like you know zoom zoom on my ass like what the fuck is that I'm trying to fucking kill you and dip the fuck out of there you know what I'm saying and not only that, she was annoyed, she was a bitch of a character in the story, you know. Um, honestly, this storyline was honestly my favorite because it's it's like, it's more raw, like, pause, right? Not that type of raw, but like, you know, it's real. Not really real, but I don't know, I don't know what I'm trying to fucking say. I'm saying like, they didn't try to censor it as much because, you know, the bros, Ice-T was playing Balix. How the fuck did I just get down? I fucking killed myself there. I'm not fucking ass at the game, so shut up. So yeah, um, in the story, she was a bitch, you know, messing my boy Balix, right? And dude, the story for this was just so raw, you know. They literally, he literally just straight up told her, "Shut up, bitch," right? And you know, you know that's not raw to you, but according to like video games and stuff, you know, that's I guess a step up from you know what video games are now, but still. That's why she's a bitch. Um, she's tanky. She fucking moves around. Like, I can't get any shots off her. You need the right setup to... See, oh my fucking... I just killed myself again. Alright. So you need the right setup to fight her and kill her. And the gun she drops... The, um... Fuck, what is this called? But I'm using it right now. I forgot I forgot what it was called. Um, Because I don't even fucking use it that much. But it's like the Brainstormer, if you know what that gun is. And... Honestly, it's an okay gun if you have the right setup. So yeah, she's a bitch. Okay, I made my decision. 6 9 if I catch you lacking in these fucking streets, I'm gonna make that brain fluid leak on the concrete on site. Alright, so in number two, we have Katagawa Jr., man. Now, almost everybody in the community hates to farm him. Because he really be doing the most to just die like like look okay, at he's doing all this that batman tumbling shit ninja warrior shit to really just take fucking my schlong bong 12 inch horse cock right for that yellow cake 2 billion hundred fucking damage so like i don't know why he can't just die instantly so as you can see here he's just fucking flipping around and so and you can shoot at him all you want when he's flipping around but it's going to do nothing cuz as long when that shield's gone when he's flipping around it's, you see, look at nothing's happening to him. He takes no damage besides the shield, and the shield doesn't matter because it's instantly gonna regen anyway. And so you have to wait till he splits up into four, and now you have to play guess who? Fucking where's Waldo? Looking ass. And so you just shoot each and one of them. He also has that one attack where like it makes you blind. So stupid. So look, as you see, I find him and fuck his shit up. And the only reason he's not number one is because have because he's super easy like if you're struggling with him um you probably suck at the game sorry to say but yeah he's super easy um he also drops the sandhawk which is fucking op as hell so that's why he's like not number one because he at least like once you're done fighting him you get like this small little reward and if you do get the sandhawk by the way drop rates are shit so you're probably not gonna get it but yeah, almost everyone hates him. He's annoying to farm. Why can't he just die right away? He does, he'd really be doing the most. And yeah, that's it. I didn't even get the fucking sand dog, so that's nice. I just like the way your lips moving. Suck your mouth. Alright, so at number one at the cream de la com or crop whatever the fuck it the saying is um is the rampager as you can see so this fucking kool-aid man 
fucking orcs from siege looking ass charging at you is one hell of a bitch. That's all I have to say. So, first off, he's fucking charging at me like, like what the fuck, bro? He really having a tamp, a temper tantrum, and in this hole, okay. And first of all, the arena is open, but fucking looks shit, bro. Looks like I just took a whole ass donkey gorilla crap, all right, in the fucking toilet. And so he's annoying because he be fucking running around all over the place, doing the crazy shit. And I don't even know where his Christmas. I'm hitting his Christmas here, but like. I really don't know where the fuck it is. I think it's in his mouth, which is fucking sus as hell for him, right? I guess it's in his mouth, but it's hella hard to hit his mouth when he's fucking running all over the place, right? And so he's super tanky. How are you supposed to kill him if he's super tanky and you can't even hit his crit spots? Doesn't make sense, right? And so also he also does this stupid charge shit. Like I'm supposed to just chill there, as you can see. I'm really just chilling out, just chilling. And he's doing this whole ritual. He's fucking screaming too. He has that fucking eyes flare thing. Like what I have in my thumbnail. What a loser, man. What a loser. Alright, then he starts to destroy the place. Like, starts puking on me. Um, starts jumping around more. This, oh, he also changed elements. So it's kind of like, kind of hard to fight him when he's changing elements. Because like one gun works, then the other one won't. Then, like, what the fuck is this, bro? What is that beam? And it, honestly, I only really hate him because it takes so long to kill. Um, he's like, this fight took me like a whole four minutes. I'm checking the recording right now. Yeah, like four minutes. Um, he's really just walking around. Doing, you know, whatever. Honestly, I really don't know what else to say. I'm just really waiting for that part where he starts going all over the place like some crackhead. And he's just telling So he's really tanky. And the reason he's number one instead of Katagawa Jr. is because he drops nothing. There's nothing he drops. Um, there's one dedicated drop he has, which is the Krakatoa. And that gun's good only if you have a certain anointment on it. But yeah, with Katagawa Jr., he has the Sanok. The Sanok's actually good. No matter what. And this guy, he drops fucking dog feces. Like, come on. He starts puking on me. I'm honestly just rambling until he gets to the part where he starts you know going around uh, honestly I'll just end the video here um, if you enjoyed leave a like down below so as we watch the fight and wait for him to turn into a crackhead and start jumping all over the base place um, but yeah if I'm shooting his ass what the fuck uh, <laughs> so if you enjoyed the video like subscribe Turn the bell notification thingy on. Um, comment what games I should play next. Um, some Borderlands content ideas you want me to do. Um, what else? Also, comment your list if you're like that, I guess. Who you think is the most bitch ass, bitch made bosses in this game. Um, so, yeah. So, here's him jumping around like a bitch. But, yeah, subscribe if. Uh, I don't know. Subscribe if. Damn, bro. Subscribe if you got a big cock. There. Remember the times we had. The times that you and me had. Remember the times we had. The times that you and me had.